coming in last year on Christmas time, they uh, were welcoming me with open arms and uh, they let me grow as a player and as a person. Honestly, where do I start? It was a great journey. Um, I'm so honored to be part of this program. So many, so many good times, so many, played with so many good players and uh, I had so much fun and I, I wouldn't want to be anywhere else. You know, our overagers this year have really been a big impact to us. We get uh, Jacob Hudson, who's been a Wildcat for four years now and does everything the Wildcat way. We have Tristan Dejean, who joined us a couple years ago as a free agent, who really has just fit in like a glove. You know, he's high quality, high character, and has really shown the way as a great leader. We have uh, Dakota Lund Cornish, who joined us at Christmas last year. We knew we made the trade. We were getting a quality individual, a maritime boy. We've been very lucky with the three individuals we had. They really shown the way and, and really did things the right way and the Wildcat way, and uh, we we're very lucky to have all three of them. Well, I think we've got our young group, and, and having uh, you know uh, Sheehan and, and, and Vinny and Nat, like those two are young goaltenders, and, and seeing uh, Dakota as a quiet leader, but he gets prepared as well as any, any uh, player, and uh, he, he comes in, does his work, competes hard, cares for his teammates and, and the team and his his, uh, his performance and he showed tremendous leadership on and off the ice. As a person, Dak's a great guy. He's uh, off the ice. As a goalie, he's still a leader in the room, um, very personable. He's uh, really driven in terms of his academics, always working on that. In terms of his personality, he's just a good guy to be around and, and talk to. And I think he's helped lead the way for our young goalies this year and he's definitely made an impact on our team. You know, there's lots of games that I can mention where he's saved us from getting down and kept us in a win. So on the ice and off the ice, he's, he's a great player. I think the overwhelming support that this organization gave me, um, I had a, a great time kind of learning and uh, developing my skills more and more with our, the staff here. And Mr. Irving's obviously really amazing with everything he gives us and all the support he offers. I think Tristan has been a, a, a great leader for a group. He's, uh, he calms our, our young decor down when it's time. He's, he's easy. He's an easy guy to talk to uh, during games and off the ice also. He's, he's got a good uh, pulse of the dressing room. His play on the ice speaks for itself. He's, he's a guy that we, we use in all situations and, and against uh, best lines on most nights. And he's been a tremendous leader for our team. As a player, he's a guy that you want to be on the ice with. You know, he's definitely a guy that got your back. He's just relentless on the ice, very hard worker, very tough competitor. I love having him, him on our team. He's been unreal. In the dressing room, he's a leader. He leads by example on the ice, and he's very vocal as well. He's just he's a gifted hockey player. He's got the work ethic, and you know he's going to have a good career. So uh, I'm very fortunate to, to be able to share some memories with him the past three years. and. I'm not very excited to, to be on a team without him, that's for sure, I'll miss him. From the staff down, you know, we talk about the management, we can talk about the owner. Um, everybody's invested in this organization and it uh, speaks a lot to the character of the group and the players that they bring in. So as soon as I came in, I felt like I was part of the team. Um, I could make a role and just play to my identity. And then with the coaching I had over the three years, I've learned so many things in terms of uh, professional development on and off the ice. You know, I had support in academics, just in life in general too, when I needed it. And you know, that's that's the biggest thing. You want to be comfortable when you go to an organization and know that they can take care of you for the time that you're there. And that's exactly what I did. I think they allowed me to develop as a person, and I got so much stuff that I learned along the way. Well, I think I think Jacob has been a tremendous. Uh tremendous captain this year uh, he didn't have it easy earlier in the season didn't play a lot of games uh, having having uh, four over ages but really making up for it now uh, he's a bit of a throwback uh, an old type player plays with a lot of emotion uh, he's been a, a good captain and, and a leader on and off the ice uh, he leads with his uh, actions on the ice he, he's he's playing hard every night uh, he plays a physical game He's also a lot of fun. Uh, he comes to the rink, he, his enthusiasm uh, to the game is, is contagious. Yeah, Hadiz is uh, he's a great leader, great person overall. I think he obviously, he brings a huge calming effect to the younger guys since we have so many. And he, uh, he really teaches them the way of how to be a, a real pro. Um, I think that's a big thing coming into this league. You kind of figure out how to be a pro and how not to be. And 
He, uh, he gives us a chance every day to learn from him and kind of follow his, his example, whether it be vocally or his, through his hard work, stuff like that. So I think he's a, he's a great person overall. Well, it means a lot. Uh, it's a second home to me. I was drafted in 2016 uh, by this great organization. I played 10 games my, my 16 year old year, um, got some experience, made the team the following year, had a pretty good season coming on to this year. I mean, it's been great. We got a lot of young guys, uh, but we're having a lot of fun and, and our work ethic's great. Uh, I love being around the rink and uh, I love what Moncton's done and it just means so much to me to, um, you know, have a second ho home in Moncton and uh, the organization has been unbelievable for me in my whole career and I'm very fortunate to play here and very thankful. Hey fans, this is Jacob Hudson, number 92 for your Moncton Wildcats. I want to personally congratulate our first Rogers Ultimate Fan winner, Andrea Boudreau. Our friends at Rogers are sending Andrea a new Apple iPhone and 12 months of free Ignite TV service. On top of that, she wins an autographed jersey signed by our team, a virtual tour of our dressing room, and a virtual phone call with me. Fans! You still have a chance to win the Rogers Wildcats Ultimate Fan Experience Contest. Visit rogerswildcatscontest.ca to enter now before our next draw.